Knock one more. Last one, Marcel. Last one. one, one I'm pushing one, straight, one, Marcel. He said once, he has to heal. Two guys? You knocked three, no? Yeah, I knocked two. Or... I knock one, then one up. One. He's rezzing in the smoke, he's rezzing my guy, I think. Yeah. Nice. What do we have, He's now all over the Kura próbuje na was wjechać. Dobra, ja walę do get on top of, of the top of the hill just below Achumachera. This is going to be interesting to see. And meanwhile here, Polish power is trying to hold their compound as Vikurvi gets closer. We are talking about the first and the second team on the leaderboard. This is a very interesting fight chance. It looked like Snuckers were going to try and get involved as well, but that didn't end up happening. Crudio now realizing he is in a very awkward position, does not want to be here for much longer, just going to do everything he can to remain in it, check in all of those windows, but realizes it is going to be a rough position. Polish power open up with a little bit of util. Dedrick spotted out in the open. Norkis look like whether it is going to maybe cause some problems going into the later game. Cryptober, though. They've been looking up to the north, doing what he can to try and land some shots towards Polish power. Not going to be successful, but now Brick's going to be the one getting crashed. Bricks is a uh, one a man here in the compound, and Jamboree did try to get closer. However, Bricks is just going to get confirmed as Jamboree is just running away with a vehicle. I mean, you can't blame him really. Polish power went so super strong towards this compound that uh, I was I was saying earlier it's not a good start for the team diamond and that's that's the problem when you're sitting in the middle of the zone right they did a huge split as well they were looting uh, some uh, really good positions and now they wanted to get prior positions and but when you are the team that is sitting in the middle of the circle it can always be a double-edged sword right May polished power powering up the whole kill feed it's Marcelek Krunio and Knorki Knorki actually I remember the first game I wrote down like Marcelek on fire and then I look at Knork and he has more kills than him so yes Polish power boys being Polish power always yes. exactly let's see the Dimash power on fire and copy nice spray with the sword Kicks. he passed for now Runeo and Orkis hunting him down. Runeo, who hunts him down finally. Jinx is down and out. 
in to the fullest and able to put some damage out because of it. Cappy closes up the gap. The need is in hand. It's going to be his final frag. Is it going to be able to land? It looks close. It converts to an arc. Double's going to be out of it. This has to be the opening for Polish power to start making a push. Crunio is moving in as well. Going to back up his teammate as flashbangs come over the top. Dedrick's taken and caught with it. Throws down a smoke, but Nail appears in this. He's moving up behind. Sees Marbo. Gets himself the knock. Now it's only Dedrick's left standing here for the Kirby. Currently on first place team. If they go down, it could be the time for another squad to overtake. And it looks like it. Cappy cleans it up. And Tropic now looking to clutch things out. The spray lands towards Cappy. So does the need as he returns the fire. Frax coming through. Left, right, and... Hey, uh, they don't have patrols on the southern side, on the other side of the hill to shoot from the distance. So, yeah, they're going to be completely pinned down there. But, I mean, one... Okay, even not one knock is going to change much. They need two knocks, and then they actually have a chance to do something about it. But, yeah, it's going to be so hard. And Polish power, let's see how much ammo they actually have. They should have their utilities as well. Master's going to find a nice shot. And that nade actually could finish the job. That's going to take down Perfectis. So he's down and just Spyro remaining. And now we can see Mars like already coming down. He wants to get that tray on point. Spyro, he needs to have the battle of his lifetime because it's one versus four. Can he do the same at teams that yesterday? Is he gonna throw a pan? Doesn't have the pan or does he have the pan? That's the question. But let's see what Mars like can come up here. We'll try to find something. Spyro just down below. And let's see Mars like they, they just, they're just you know battling who's gonna find that kill first. And Mars like he wants to. Oh my god, that's the angle. And then there we go, Polish power, 13 kill, chicken dinner. To do half the damage, it was a really nice AWM shot through the smoke to be able to connect. As Kill Yukai finds himself yet another knock, this time onto Nork. It's Mika going to use it as an opportunity to start pushing through, realizes just how dangerous this could be. Polish power down below. They've only got a smoke for cover, and Murado's there, but they don't expect a player to be this close. Mika, though, can't land the spray. He does it in the end, gets the headshot, but Grunio is there for the trade. Kill Yukai is the final player left up, doing everything he can to try and pre fire, but he realizes he could be getting pushed from behind. It's the needs that are going to be the first thing to come through. The flashbang is dead on the Frag's a little bit closer, but it doesn't quite land the vehicle there for cover as it is just an absolute red zone now for Kill Yakai, the boy's final hope as Polish power swarmed through 17 kills so far, making 18 and a chicken dinner. 28 points picked up in one game by Polish power. And this time it is coming straight for the kill. He's gonna go through the smoke. Oh, no. Yo! Aggression. The best defense is offense, and it's 1v3 for Lou. Oh, Polish power are just making a rank game from it. What in the freaking hell is going on? And it was not taking some damage. Lou with great spray on Marcelic. 36 HP left. He still have one more nade to Molotov. Taking a rock, taking a cover, getting flashed. Now he has to throw the nade. Ooh, ho, ho. Well, Polish Power, they did it with 18 kill win. All the one versus one. Spots Cabby, peeks at him, Hell's fresh level two helmet, only a level one vest to work with though. Does it go for a vehicle here? What is the play? Cappy versus the boom. It's a 1v1. Cappy spots him to the right side of the smoke. From a Polish Power had more utility earlier, although now that it's a 1v1. There's no way he goes for the rest here. Oh, no, 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 no. This could be the death of you. This could be the death of you. And it might just be the max range nade met by a max range nade in return. Cappy throws it, steals the deal, and Polish power wins it with 11 kills. That was a brilliant end to the game. And once again, down to the wire, making it a 1v1. These individual players squeezing some fantastic moments.